Welcome to the Nintendo room. And I have a lot of handheld systems and games. So in this video, I'm going to show you my entire Nintendo handheld collection. The first one is the original Game Boy from 1989. It's missing the screen cover, but it still works. And I have Tamagotchi and Tetris for it, and it's really fun. And then next I have the two DS lights that I have the red one and the white one. And these are all the games I have for it. Um, I'll give you a shot of that. I'm missing the actual cartridges for Mario Kart DS and Mario Party DS, but all the other ones in this deck, I have the cartridges inside. And then I do have some loose games, Mario and Luigi, Bowser's Inside Story, New Super Mario Bros, Pokemon Soul Silver, and Pokemon Black. And um, the disc, I mean the cartridge readers on these don't work, so, um, the, the Game Boy Advance um, thing um, does work, so I'm able to play Game Boy Advance games on them. And that's pretty much all I use them for. And I'll show you what I play my normal DS games on right now. I play my normal DS games on the DSi. Um, because this one actually is able to read DS cartridges. Those two have like broken ones, I guess. And um, yeah, I also like use like the Flip Note Studio that's on the DSi. And it's pretty fun. I actually used to have one of these when I was little. And it's cool to have another one that I got last December after Christmas. Like, three days after Christmas I got this at a GameStop. On to the newer systems. I have um, two 2DSs. Two one that's the black and blue. And one that's the white and light blue. I'm not really sure what exact color that is. But this is how many games I have for the 3DS compared to the DS games. Um, so... I'm not going to name all of them because there's a lot of them. Some of these I don't have the actual cartridges for, but I do have the cases because I lost the cartridges. But um, we have the Animal Crossing games, Detective Pikachu, Donkey Kong Country, the Kirby games, the Mario and Luigi games, the three Mario Party games, Mario Tennis Open, Miitopia, New Super Mario Bros. 2, Paper Mario, Superstar, the Pokemon games, Super Mario 3D Land, Legend, The Legend of Zelda, Triforce Heroes, Tomonacho Life, Ultimate NES Remix, Yokai Watch and Yoshi's New Island. And down here, without the case, I have Mario Kart 7. I'm trying to get the camera to focus on that. No. But it's Mario Kart 7. And then with this one, I actually have a stand for it from Rose Colored Gaming. Um, that's where you can get like stands for handheld systems and controllers. I eventually need to get all of the stands for those. Um, I'll leave a link to that in the description. And anyway, let's move on to the last few things I have for handhelds. The last handheld system I have is the new Nintendo 2DS XL. And this is what I play all my 3DS games on, um, just because I like this and I got this for Christmas. Um, and it's really cool. Um, it's, like their own, it's like the normal 2DS, it doesn't have the 3DS feature, but it has this extra button that's on all the new like 3DS family systems. And it closes. I don't know if I already said that, but um, here yeah, it's basically this, but it can fold close and it has a bigger screen. Well, um, I think that's all the handheld stuff I have. Um, I might edit in like an update at the end of the video in case I missed anything, but um, I think that's it for this video. So, one last look at my entire handheld collection from Nintendo, and I'll see you next time. I actually did miss something, and that's the new Nintendo 2DS XL box. That's all I have to say. I actually was going to include that in the video, but I actually forgot. So that's all I'm going to say. Um, so, bye. I also have a tiny red Game Boy keychain.